On January 31, Turkey's Presidency of Defense Industries, or SSB, published a new video announcing the defense industry's ambitions for 2022. The design of Turkey's prospective landing helicopter dock, LHD, Anadolu, appears to have been modified in the footage to deploy more unmanned aerial vehicles, UAV. Just like in 2021, SSB released a video to announce Turkey's 2022 goals in defense industry. The video includes deliveries of defense products and milestones in important projects in all domains, naval warfare, air warfare, land warfare, as well as civilian applications. The Bayraktar TB3 UCAV, which can land and take off on ships with short runways, will take to the skies for the first time this year. The Bayraktar TB3 UCAV will thereafter be integrated into the multi-purpose amphibious assault ship Anadolu. According to the video, the integration of TB3 armed drones, which are currently being produced specifically for carriers by the Baker Defense Company, aboard LHD Anadolu would begin in 2022. This is a foregone conclusion given that the Turkish government and Baker firm declared the conversion of LHD Anadolu into a drone carrier. The rendering of Anadolu, on the other hand, sparked discussion regarding the size of the carrier's runway and the number of drones on deck. When compared to current LHD Anadolu photos and prior renderings, the new illustration depicts a wider and longer runway aboard the ship. On the deck, there are approximately 40 folded wing drones, according to the new image. Though the rendering suggests a wider and longer runway for drone operations, such a modification to an LHD could take a long time for the Turkish Navy. The Turkish Navy's need for and excitement about the new LHD is well known. The Anadolu commissioning was one of the SSB's 2021 projections, but it does not feature in the movie presenting the SSB's 2022 agenda. This might be interpreted as SSB not expecting to deliver LHD Anadolu in 2022. Even though SSB could be able to deliver LHD Anadolu to the Turkish Navy in the first quarter of 2023, there would be a two-year delay. As a result, executing such a massive upgrade appears impractical at the moment, and would almost certainly significantly increase the ship's cost. Another possibility is that the rendering in the video belongs to Turkey's second LHD, which will be known as Trakya. Turkish President Erdogan recently revealed Turkey's plans to build an aircraft carrier in collaboration with Spain, probably Navantia, and this remark was taken by experts as the second LHD. Erdogan stated in his announcement that the new ship will be larger and more capable than the LHD Anadolu. If we combine the most recent drawing with the Turkish president's words, we get a conceptual design for Turkey's second LHD. Time will tell.